Hello, awesome Oboe students and Oboe Files watchers. It's audition season at the end of the year for a lot of middle and high school Oboe students. For my students at Pearland Junior High West and Pearland High School and Struck Middle School, I've recorded their audition music as a model for them to work with. Now, in general for auditions, just remember to play beautifully, do what you know how to do, and just play what you've prepared. I know you're gonna feel a little nervous for the audition, but just remember, it's not a big deal. You've worked really hard throughout the year, and you're just trying to show off what you've learned. So, good luck. A few notes on the middle school audition for Pearland Junior High West. The tunes are pretty simple, so just sing lyrically, use vibrato if you've developed it, and just kind of have fun with those etudes. Don't try to play them too fast. They sound good at really moderate tempos, so just play how you know how to play and just play beautifully. All right, so I'm just gonna read these off my phone. Here we go. Hello, this is the Klein ISD Middle School Audition Etude for 2018-2019. It's not every middle school, but some middle schools have this etude in E flat. And if this is your etude, make sure that you practice the end slowly enough to match what you can do technically and work that up to tempo until it matches what you can already do at the beginning of the etude. So I know it gets harder as it goes on, so maybe start at the end because that's going to take a little bit more work from you. Try to avoid playing through it th as you practice in your sessions, but instead isolate little sections to work on. Maybe in this case, as I've said, the end of the etude with all the fast notes would be a great place to isolate before you maybe play through it at the end of your practice session. Good luck, and as always, when in doubt, play beautifully. For the Pearland High School etudes, the first one is about to be modeled here. The second one you can find by clicking up here on the tag in the corner. Uh, it might be in this corner. And if you can't find it there, just go down the description. Uh, it's one of the Barrett etudes in F major. Uh, so for this one, for the high school edition for the slow etude, make sure that you pay attention to the key, I think is the hard part. 
and don't go too fast. You might want to count it with eighth notes instead of quarter notes and just draw in vertical hash marks wherever the beat goes. So you might have four per measure or if you're doing an eighth notes, eight per measure and just make sure you know where every single note is supposed to go. Again, the key is a little tricky. Just make sure you know the fingerings for when you have double sharps and remember how to play in C sharp minor. For the fast etude, don't go too fast. Uh, it's a lot of tricky, you know, six, eight technique. So just take it easy and remember that you know how to play an F major. Okay, good luck and I hope you have fun. This is the Pinellaland High School Band Slow Etude and this is quite the rhythm etude. Okay, hello, this is the audition music for the end of the year evaluation for Ehrlich Middle School or Intermediate School, I forget which one they call it, and also some of the other schools in Klein ISD. So if this is your audition music, um, just a couple quick tips. As similar to the other Klein ISD audition music, it gets harder as you go. So kind of pick the one you think you can do. Uh, they're in variation, so pick the variation you think you can do and work that up at a slow tempo before playing through it at the tempo that you know you can do the beginning at. So maybe just pick uh, one or two measures in variation four, or if you're feeling really capable, variation five, and work that up slowly and see how it goes. With the tougher variations, don't give up at the beginning. They might be a little bit inaccessible at first, but I think you can figure them out they're not too bad as long as you're writing in your music, keeping notes, which is very important, and writing in where the downbeats and maybe if you need alternate fingerings, go ahead and write those in if you need a left handy flat to get to a D flat or a forked F, that's really good to write in. All right, good luck and I hope this model helps. Okay, so I'll, I'll hold up, uh, I'll just announce every variation as we go. So this is the theme. Variation 3, which changes to F major. Kind of. <laughs> Here's variation 3, which changes to 1 flat instead of 3. Here's variation 4, 
explanation for is really in, like a Dorian F at the end, uh, if we've covered the drunken sailor lesson. Here's variation five, which changes time signature into two four, so it has like a faster uh, macro beat pattern, and it has some interesting tonal harmonies, kind of modal harmonies. out, play beautifully, and make sure you taper all the ends of your notes. Um, keep the tongue on the reed when you start, and make sure you're using enough air pressure to keep the notes all the way up to pitch. As always, keep singing, keep playing, and good luck with your audition.